morning. I'm Precious Mola with your news updates. News making headlines this hour. I will only resign if asked by Ramaphosa, says Malusi Gigaba. ANC NEC slams Mboweni over remarks on SAA. SACP issues warning to ANC over SABC retrenchments. Home Affairs Minister Malusi Gigaba has broken his silence following a week of controversies and says he will only step down if he is asked to do so by the president. Calls for the minister to step down have been mounting after public protector Busisi Wemkwebani directed President Cyril Ramaphosa to take appropriate disciplinary action against Gigaba for lying under oath in court. Nikki Oppenheimer, the former chairperson of Diamond Mine De Beers and one of South Africa's wealthiest people, told a parliamentary committee last week that Gigaba had initially approved his family's plan to open a private terminal at OR Tambo Airport in 2016. It was the latest setback for Gigaba, who said last week that he had faced blackmail threats over a private sexual video that was leaked after he reported that his phone had been hacked. Should retrenchments go ahead at the SABC and other government entities, it could cause the ANC a chunk of the workers. SACP wants the ANC. The party hosted its annual Red October rally on Sunday in Nyangam, joined by its alliance partner in the province. The focus for the 2018-2019 Red October campaign was under the theme Stop Corruption, Serve the People Selflessly. The SACP also warned the ANC not to sideline it. The ANC's NEC has lamed Finance Minister Tito Mboweni for his remarks that the SAA should be closed down, saying ANC employees in government must stick to the party's resolution. Minister Mboweni told Investors Conference in New York last week that there is no need for the state to run an airline that it could not afford. SAA, which has not generated a profit since 2011, survives on state guarantees and is regularly cited by credit ratings agency as a drain on the government's purse. From the rest of the team and I, goodbye.